What is up? A G Z gang. Yes, sir. Now, guys, we are 4.8k subs. What? Quarter 4k is almost over. It'll probably be over by the end of tomorrow. If not the end of the weekend, I'm assuming. I, I'm going to give it the end of tomorrow. We're going to get that 5k by the end of tomorrow. And that's crazy. That is crazy. That is very crazy. Um, whew, We're halfway. Guys, we are halfway. <laughs> we are halfway from 10k. That is mind boggling. Um, I I I'm speechless. But guys, I don't even want to keep you here for too long. <laughs> if you haven't hit the subscribe button already, what are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? Join the gang. Just join the gang. God damn, you know what I'm Hey, you know the grind never stops. Post notification bell so you know when I post. And I say, let's get into the video. Hey, GZ gang. Yes, sir. Guys. Uh, this is a video for the guys that, you know, that, that are underleveled, need some help, need some guidance with the game. Because I have seen quite a few of them, actually. Um, you'd be surprised. Some people haven't even hit Skypea yet. Well, guys, this is my guide from level whatever you are. <laughs> so I'm level 105 to level 175. The reason why specifically those levels is because those were the those that was the cap. That was the old cap to the new max increase before update two. Um, so this is for you guys, and I will have a 175 to 250 guide come out about three to four hours after this video comes out. So guys, bear with me. I'm here to help. <laughs> now let's get into this. So, you finally reached Skype here. You're, I'm gonna assume you're about level 105, and you finally reached Skype here. Now you must be thinking, what do I do? You know what I'm saying? Once you land, uh, you come here. I'm gonna try to remember the best way I can. Um, please, 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 uh, bye a log for skypea and set your spawn now over here you can buy the shark repellent and the health regen i've never really spent money on those to be honest with you but yeah do as you please uh the first place you go at 105 is this direction so um that's where you set your spawn and to the back of that is this little bridge you're gonna see this very very handsome man with the quest you click on Virgo get the quest and you fight these guys damn that boy blocked me um so yeah you're just gonna defeat these guys five times damn they be blocking me god damn uh, just gonna do the quest because why not? Oh, be careful for the shotgun guy. He does uh, that damage. Okay, why well, did the quest? I don't know. So you finish the quest, um, and you're gonna do this quest uh, a couple times. I'm gonna say until you reach about da -da 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 either 115 or 120. So you wanna do that's what you wanna do this quest for. Once you get to about 115 or 120, or anywhere around that range, um, 
I'm not gonna fly, I'm just gonna walk it. You're gonna wanna come back this way. This is where you were, uh, this is where you buy the drinks, you set your spawn, you come up this bridge. Blah, 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 blah. I don't know what this guy's purpose is, by the way. You come up this bridge. You come up this bridge. And you set your spawn. Once you set your spawn, you come up here. You talk to the fat guy over here. So you talk to Zane. And you do the castle guards. Now, I recommend you to stay here. I recommend you to stay here and do this quest until you're... Um, until you reach max level and the reason I say this is because you do this quest you have to defeat five castle guards by the time you've completed um you've beat all five they would have respawned you can come back out get the quest again and do it over and over and the quest the quest is right next to where you have to um go to defeat the targets um I believe there is a boss quest upstairs and there's another quest to defeat the, the boss um, guardians or whatever they're called. But I don't recommend doing those because they take long to do. Yeah, it gives you more EXP, but it takes longer to do. So small amount of EXP over a small amount of time equals more EXP than a, lo a, a large amount of EXP over a long period of time. So you're better off staying here until you reach 175. That's what I did. Um, I'm pretty sure that's what a lot of my crew members that farmed with me did too. Um, up here is the Sky Coliseum for PvP. If you're on a server, you can do this command. And you can't you can't train your hockey, you can't damage NPCs. You can just go in there and PvP your friends, and there's like a heal pad and a stamina pad, so you guys can. You know, you don't have to grip each other to reset. You just put them on the pads and it resets the health and the... Yep. Yeah. So, if you don't know, now you know. Um, yeah, stay here until max. And that's about it. Now, uh, the boss is here. If you go in here... Oh my god. Go in here and you go upstairs. You get this guy and he lets you defeat... The guy standing in the back, he gives a guardian helmet, this item here, and um, the helmet gives plus 75 HP, and he also gives uh, sky blue katana, which um, does a little bit more damage than normal katana, and it's for one sword style users. So one sword style users have another sword to get. Um, and there is another boss which I will show you right now. Now this boss, even I haven't done him. Probably will do him after I record this video. Um, before, there used to be a boss here. It was a limited time boss um, for Christmas. Santa. Santa gave you this, this little candy cane. Flash freeze. If you get hit by this and you stand in it, you turn into an ice block and sweet treat. It heals you over time okay back to my weapon um, but yeah now the boss here if you beat him he gives you a shotgun and I'm not gonna farm that and those are the quests here um, he's pretty easy he's pretty easy maybe it's cuz I'm like max level I'm saying that but he is pretty easy and now I'm gonna show you the the other area you go to So, you go back up there, set your spawn, well you don't have to, once you're up here, you come back down, and you run all the way up here. What's all the way up here? Why is it so long? Once you finally get up, talk to this guy, set your spawn here, because you're going to need to do that. 
Um, I'm going to show you what's over here. So this quest, you click on him and you fight NL. See NL over there being a badass. Um, NL gives you, gives you golden staff and gives you this. Uh, this item gives you, I think it's like plus 60 health and then it gives you stamina regen and, and yeah, it's really good. I do recommend it. Uh, click on re, uh, it gives you a quest to defeat those guys. Click on this guy and he gives you the quest to beat this guy and he drops the, the sky cannon, whatever it's called. I haven't done the quest because I personally don't feel like the weapon is that good. Um, you can do them. It's not that hard to do them. So you could probably solo them. By the time you reach 175, doing doing bosses kind of gets easier. And in over here in this hut is where you get the quest for Ken Haki. If you don't know what Ken Haki is, once you get the quest, you have to you get 10 Ken Haki dodges. And if you don't know what that is or you need help doing it, go on my channel. I have videos uh, to help you do that. I already have a Skypea, well not a Skypea guide. I have a video on how to defeat Anel. I have a video on um, how to train, how to train your um, Ken Haki. So yeah, those videos are already out and able to help you guys. So that's pretty much it. I don't recommend um, doing the quest here to level. Um, do as I said, go to the castle guardians and just, and just do the quest there. I recommend you stay there until max level. It might get a bit repetitive, it might get tedious, but it is the best way to level here in Skypea. Um, hopefully this video was helpful. Uh, and I'm gonna see you guys in the next one. Boom, boom, bow, yes sir.